How's it going? What's your name? Emmeline Ronigo. How, how do you spell it? Emmeline Ronigo. Emmeline? Yes. Oh. Off the Oglala Sioux tribe. Oh, the Sioux tribe? Yes, from South Dakota. South Dakota? Oh. And I have five boys from the Red Lake Indian Reservation, and they're all tribal members. Oh, cool. Me, I'm a Lakota Sioux. Lakota Sioux? Lakota Sioux. Oh, cool. So that's where you're from originally, South Dakota? Yes. All right. uh, how did you get to Portland? I have two sisters. Huh? And they're, um, they don't drink, they don't smoke. I'm the bad one oh, that wow. smokes and drinks. Oh, wow. <laughs> but they're good sisters. Oh, I'm cool. the oldest of 18 kids. 18 kids? I'm the oldest. Wow. So were your parents, you had both parents growing up, huh? Yeah. My mom passed away on a, that mad against drunk drivers. That's when my mom left me. Oh. Then my dad went past away just three weeks after that. Oh, well, sorry to hear that. Mm -hmm. But yeah, anyway, I have, and I became a grandma. Oh, cool. You know what? It had to be a boy. If it was a little girl, I'd rush back to Minnesota and take care of that little girl. No, I had to be a boy. Eventually, I love babies. Yeah. My boys, yeah, just love me too. So, so, so how was it growing up in uh, in South Dakota? I never was raised there. Oh, you were? Where were you no, raised? No, all over. All over? My mom went and um, she had me go live with her brothers and sisters, staying off the reservation because she knew there's like alcohol and you know, a bunch of abuse. Oh, on the reservation there? Mm -hmm. So yeah, so that's why I raised that. So, you, so your uncle raised you, your aunt? All my uncles and all my aunties, oh, they wow. all raised me. Why I'm so like still alive today. Oh wow. They raised me. So, so was it, did you have a good childhood? I mean. Yeah, I did. With your uncles and yeah. your cousins? And Cause you know what my Auntie Virginia used to do to me? Fry that bacon loud, make it burn so I get up for the school. That alarm will go off. So I have to get up and go to school. Oh, cool. But yeah, I was doing real good until my mom left me. You know, my mom went to pass away. My dad went right along with. So me and my brothers and sisters, they just don't understand what a hard life is when you got to know your mom and your dad. They only met them just because they were just little kids. My mom used to beat me up and hurt me just so, just, just so she would just get mad, you know? Cause my dad would go out on her and, you know. Anyway, that's what that's kind horrible. of yeah. But anyway, that's what I my child was. Wow. Now I have five boys. What's your best memory of uh, your childhood? Best memory uh -huh. is my dad using my um jacket, my jacket for the pine stripes, and it had Rony go on it. That's the best thing I remember is oh, cool. when my dad went and paid for my jacket because I was MVP. Oh, cool. Most valuable player. <laughs> yeah, it's most memories, good memories I have. Just me and my dad. My oh, dad cool. always paid for everything for me. Pretty nice guy. <laughs> yeah. That's he was um seven seven. Yeah, and I'm only five five. Mm -hmm. So how, how did you get to Port? I mean, how long have you been in Portland? I mean, I got here in um. Well, I flew out here in December. On December. In December, then I went back to try to make men's with my boys' dad, but no, he wasn't trying to like. He wasn't trying to do anything. So I said, when Marty's grown up, Marty's known. 
now. I, he's old enough now. I'm out. So I left my family. So, so how, how do you like uh, how do you like Portland? I'm right here. I like Portland now. Really? Yes. I live in a tent right now, but in a week and a half, I'll be moving into an apartment. Oh, cool. How, how did you get an apartment? Out of Nora. Oh, Nora? Yeah. Oh, oh that's cool. Mm -hmm. You don't have, you don't mind if I take a drink, do you? Oh, you can do whatever you want, man. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. so, so do you, uh, you have any uh, life regrets? Life? What? Life regrets uh -huh. is my brothers and sisters are always attached to me. And they just get me mad because when they have a problem, I talk to them. But when I have a problem, call them, they don't want to talk to me either. Oh, wow. So that's why I'm like, fuck you fucking Rony goes, stay the fuck out of my life. Me, I'm on my own. I barely got my name back. My name, my last name used to be Benjamin. Benjamin? Yeah, that was what my last name was. Do you, you have any, uh, any plans for the future or anything? Yeah, I'm moving in my apartment. Uh -huh. Oh, that's cool. Mm-hmm. Cool. Then I plan on um, lifting more weights and going basketball. Oh yeah, getting in shape. Getting in shape. You know how old I am? Uh, I don't. A deck of cards. A deck of cards? A deck of cards. Oh wow. Add those two for those two jokers. <laughs> I'll be I'm fifty-four. Oh, wow. Yeah. Alright, well, do you have any any advice or any quotes that you want to give anybody? Hi, Marlon Lee Black Jr. Mama loves you. <laughs> and those are my kids. Oh, there? Yeah, I almost lost my son in Red Lake shooting. All right, I almost lost my baby. To During that, that Red Lake shooting. I almost lost my baby, you know? Oh, I didn't hear about that. Now my kids, they understand. Now they understand what mom's about. Mom left because dad's fucking around on mom again. Mom's gone. So anyway, I just left them. I didn't permanently leave them. They're coming out here to live with me now. Once I, yeah, once I move in my bedroom, my two apartment bedroom, my boys are gonna come and live with me. Oh, that's cool. Then leave their old nasty ass dad. Let him stay down on the Red Lake Reservation. Let him be like that. No one would never want him more than me. No one never loved him how much I loved him. But he broke my heart, you know? He knocked my teeth out, he broke my nose, he broke my arms, my legs. Yeah, that's what the facts of life. Yeah, that's rough. Mm -hmm. So you got any, uh, any advice or any quotes you want to give anybody? Um, be safe, be healthy. Love all nations, all nations. Love everybody, love God, love Jesus, love everyone, okay? Cool, man, I appreciate it, thank you.